Hey guys, how's it going? I'm in my cousin's house and I'm gonna take her two children to the zoo in New York. Stay with us because I think we're gonna see some cool animals and these two kids' reactions. <laughs> Stop that, guys. Come on, put, put that back. We are going to the zoo. Good boy. Come here now. Come on. He just started running. Eh, walking. What <laughs> run? So. I think it's going to be a nice footage. We are going to the Bronx Zoo in New York. And he knows it. Right? Cameron, say hi. <laughs> Layla. <laughs> so what animals are we gonna see today, Leila? Um, tigers. Tigers? Yeah, monkeys. Monkeys? Nah, he wants to get out. What a good sister. So, <laughs> there they are. Sitting in the car. Hi. Good girl. We are... Getting ready to go. Come, you can't play with this while we are in the car. The brother is sleeping. We are going in. There it is, the zoo entrance. Are you excited? <laughs> so, there we are. Information Society. That's a difficult question because I didn't know we were in the Information Society. Why is rain so hard? Who said the giraffe does? Chewing like a donkey. I'm sure they all came from the same family a million years ago. Then. I really appreciate spaces like this where they keep animals. I've never seen something like that. Fish. <laughs> what is this otter trying to do? <laughs> Swimming in the air. Like, this is so warm, let's, let's take a nap. Yeah, seriously, they probably ate, and now they're like, all right. <laughs> Sharpening his... Yeah. Loving this. 
Thank you guys for watching. That was my summary of Bronx Zoo. I hope you all enjoyed it. I am going to leave you with a bonus footage. Hey, look, look, the came to say hi. I just started recording and this guy came. So I don't exactly know what species that is, but I'll do a voiceover. Yeah, I'm not sure. I can't find the name. The bird you are watching is called a Sulawesi hornbill. It is a male because it has a yellow and white face. The females are fully black. They are native to the tropical island of Sulawesi in Indonesia with the population of 20 million people which puts this bird on the red list of threatened species. And it is said to be doing better in zoos than the wild. This type of hornbill would typically live in a group of 20 individuals and it is believed that only the dominant pair breed while the remaining members of the group act as helpers. I can't believe this guy actually came here. Probably sense my bird whisperness. <laughs> Pretty awesome.